So this is this is really a random haul. It's not a monthly haul. It's not a um, seasonal haul. And it's it's, it's a, is it a sale haul? Because all this pretty much stuff I got was on sale. Like uh, it was the um, it's like a ha Halloween sale because Halloween's over, so stuff is going on sale. Um, so. I don't know what I'll be calling it, but there's tile up here. Eventually. <laughs> if you're seeing this on YouTube, then there's a the title of what I eventually called it. But let's... We're gonna get into this. We're going to get... What am I saying? I don't know. I bought this stuff the other night. Yesterday? No. I bought... I know I bought this on Tuesday. Today's Thursday. So. I bought this stuff. I bought this with Nanny. But this is my personal stuff. This is, uh, these were both 50% off. And they're from the Pier 1 Halloween collection. If you didn't notice, all the, you know, had this and it's all spidery. It's from the Halloween collection. Okay. You got it? Get almost. Come on. There. One more. There we go. Okay. So this first thing I have is a single pendant. It originally cost $7.95. And it was, it's 50% off. This turned to um, $3.88. And it's just a single pendant. Oh, this is even ta still tangled. I don't know if I told you this, but I am kind of afraid of spiders. But I'm not, uh, it and it also depends on the spider, but like your household spiders, I am kind of afraid of them, but not so afraid that I won't go up and squish them and make them go away. Uh, but bigger than that, different than that, like um, wolf spider that you can sometimes find in your garage and especially on outdoor areas. Oh, uh, hell yeah, I'm staying away from that thing because apparently it will come and attack you. But anyway, it's just a simple pendant, and I picked the orange one. They had different colors, but you know me and orange. I had to get the orange. It's a really good size, and it's, you know, it's a good chain. So, like, all right, it'd be, uh, it's, it, yeah, it'd be good about, about my boobs. I like that about my boobage area, maybe a little, maybe right about here. It showed it was right here, but it might be about here, but who wrote? Who knows? But I love it so much. I wanted it the first time I saw it, but I was like, no, I can wait. They told me that it's gonna go on this stuff is gonna go on sale. A clearance. This is sorry, it is clear it's on marked clearance. So it was like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. And eventually this is on sale. Yes. I got the I didn't get this at my usual pier one. I got the I got these at one closer to Manny's house. Well, technically his parents' house, but whatever. The other thing I have... Oof. Let me fix this so it can be viewable. There we go. Is this to go with my costume. Mm, there's your nice large spider here it's got you know th three here one there and then a bunch there on the butt it's very elegant the spider webs and then these two little ones here and they also have uh, little jewels inside them if he would stop wiggling which means I would need to stop wiggling there we go and this little bitty there's big bitty and then there's even little jewels inside, so there's one there, and then there's one here. So I think these are all like same copied ones, which is why the jewels are like where they are. But whatever. And these one just came in like standard black, which is fine because my costume is black and purple. So it's perfectly fine. And I might not even get to wear it this year, because... 
Manny's friends are not doing anything. We're, we're we want to do a Halloween party. We totally want to do one because uh, so I want to. I even have like a book. I I have a book of Halloween food, but we can't do it because like I live here with my dad. He lives with his parents. It's difficult. So anyway. Um, I still have to find out what my cousins will find out because their friends, my cousin's friend, um, usually has a Halloween party every year. And I was wondering like, hey, could we come over to the party? And, um, apparently their friend's wife was actually, had been saying, had been declining a few people who've been asked like outside of the normal people that usually come to the party because she's worried about there being enough room for everyone at the at the house, obviously. We may I may or may not be able to show my costume off this year. But I should be done purchasing stuff for my costume. The only thing I would have to repurchase every few years would be um, my teeth and my nails. Because even though I do not want to be doing like fake nails anymore because they thinned my nails out, I will do them for my costume. That's the only thing I will ever do it for, just because it goes with the whole air of it. This is the next place, Math and Body Works. I actually didn't get a whole lot from here, surprisingly. I only got four things, but technically it's two things, but double. So. Um, okay. The first I'm showing you is um, their, their soap, their hand soaps. This is from their new, uh, it's a very small fall collection that they brought out. And this, they did bring out three other other things for the co fall collection, but it's for um, you know, like a perfume, moisturizer, uh, body shower gel, that sort of stuff, not hand soaps, but like this one, I'm going to put one down and show you one. Um, this is the Cranberry Citrus and Sage. So, um, that's not a cranberry. Those are cranberry, those red things. That's a clementine, but that's probably the citrus, and that is actually cinnamon sticks. So where the heck is this sage stuff supposed to come from? But it does smell good. That's why I picked it. It's very light. From smelling it in here, you... You don't really smell anything, and then like right at the end, you get like this citrus coming out. This says here, uh, sweet cranberries, citrus, citrus zest, and hints of sage. Wow, that was difficult to say. And I like this color. This color is like a aqua blue green sort of. I think it's like both the bottle and the gel. Ugh. Also the stuff but no this is just clear so it's the actual bottle that's um uh this aqua blue green color and i got the foaming one i always make sure to smell both of them because like sometimes i think sometimes i like one over the other but i liked it in both and then the other, only other one i got uh, which was sort of the first, those, that was actually the last scent I smelled. These were the third ones I smelled. And this is Brandied Apple Pear. So obviously there's an apple and there's a pear. And then, it, you know, Brandied is like, you know, a liquid. So it's not like you could put liquid on there. So there's obviously, there probably is liquid over these things. <laughs> but anyway, Sweet Brandied Apple and Juicy Pear. And... That's what these two look like. And then like this is like a kind of like a sage forest, almost co coming to foresty green. And it's just clear gel. Ooh, I can smell the pear apple. I really like it. And I really like this color on the bottle and like on here. It's really nice. And that's all I bought from Bath and Body Works. They also had a, a pumpkin pineapple flavor. Scent, not flavor, it's a scent. I did not like that. And then the other one was a vanilla coconut one. I absolutely did not like that one. Just ruined it. Just ruined both of them with those bad smells. 
At least for me. Because I don't really like pineapple. And I don't like coconut. I really do not like coconut. I don't like the smell of it. I don't even like the taste of it. Yeah, I don't. Excuse me. Please. I am the weirdo. I don't like bacon. I don't like ham. But I like pork. I really love pork. Like pork chops and pork, well, pork, pork loin. Something else pork. But yeah, I don't like ham. I don't like bacon. don't like coconut or pineapple. And I don't like Reese's Pieces. I hate Reese's Pieces. You don't put the peanut butter in my chocolate. No. <laughs> but anyway, let me show you off the trip ones I got. Alright, so this is a single one. It is $10 off any $30 purchase or more. Valid. <gasps> yes, I can use this during Black Friday. Yeah. Because it says, um, offer valid October 19th to December 24th. Yeah. And then this is the, this is what Christmas smells like. Um, we wish you the perfect Christmas preview back from Body Works. I'm, this might not actually be, oh, there's two buttons in here. There's a free item of your choice with any $15 purchase, which I won't be able to use. Um, I will be able to use this. Um, ten dollars off, and it, uh, another coupon for it for ten dollars off any thirty dollars purchase, November sixteenth to December sixth. And then I won't be able to use this till December. It sucks. It is a twenty percent off your entire purchase. And then they're showing off the uh, uh, Be Joyful scent right here. There's a perfume, a shower gel, a uh, what is that? It's not the triple moisturizer. It's the lotion. This is a lotion right here. Um, and they have in the eau de toilette, the special one. Uh, okay, the next one is it's fresh sparkling snow which i hope is not supposed to be um a uh, frosted wonderland because i i love i love that i love that smell so much but i haven't looked on it i think i can i see pear mel pear melon frosted with winter something i don't know i'm worried about this one i'm worried if that's their supposed to be their winter one i want frosted wonderland i love so much mm. well they have a christmas sized um Japanese cherry blossom, and, uh, and then the other one down here, like it's a two, two thing front page, is the winter candy apple, so that's a, that's coming back again, and there's, it's Christmasized. And then the other two over here, oh, it's just one. It is the vanilla bean noel. For two pages. Yeah, this is the lotion in this thing. But this is the moisturizer, I love get, getting this one. I really hope that they have the um, uh, Frosted Wonderland. I love it. It smells so freaking amazing. It's like warm and cool. Not, not cool. Cool. It's warm and crisp at the same time. Like a, a wintry crispness. And then like the warmth. But if anything, I probably would have to go with the... Um, if they don't have the Frosted Wonderland, I, they, I really hope they do. It would be the uh, the Winter Candy Apple. That would probably be the one I would, I would go for if it's not there. Because I don't... I like vanilla. I really do. But it's... I don't know. It's not something for me. This bag, Michael's... Michael's... Was the last store I went to. I got coupons done for that. Oh, I have another coupon thing here. What is this? 25% off regular sale price purchase. November 6th to the 7th. Um, 5% off frames. I don't really care about that. Because I can get an even cheaper one over at the dollar store. Um, and then there's a, a four day tree event for 50% off 1.83 meter taller meter and taller tree. So, mm. Entire stock yarn event, up to 50% off over 700 styles on sale. Simply present your, whoa, oh, uh, present your military ID card and get 50% off regular in sale price off purchase. Hmm. Mm -hmm. We'll be using that. Anyway, the receipt. Receipt. Um, I got actually every everything on sale. Um, the first things here I'm showing you are two Halloween things. And it is the oven mitts, and these I just have, I wanted two because it makes sense, because sometimes you actually will go in there like this, so you need to have both your hands protected. So I got two, and these were 70% off the original price. The original price was $9.99, so about 10 bucks. I don't know how much that would be. Um. Oh, they came to two ninety nine, so about like three bucks each. Pretty nice, pretty nice, very, very nice, very nice. I'm kind of a little disappointed, like a little disappointed with um uh the Dollar Tree, Dollar Trees because I only got one of the spider thing, which is very sad. Um, and then I'm a little, I'm kind of a little sad with um uh, my Dollarama. They didn't really have anything, but I went in today, like after uh, after everything, and I was coming home. I Checked out my own Dollar Tree, Dollarama, not Dollar Tree, Dollarama, and they have um Christmas uh 
pot holders, um, <coughs> no, those are oven mitts and other sort of kitchen implements. And it's like, it's very sad. I want a Halloween stuff too. And not just the kitchen mats that I purchased. This next thing is um, bead landing 7 millimeter or 0.27 inches jump rings. And these are nickel free. These I purchased with um, my, the 50% off a single item coupon that you can get off, get off of their online website. Uh, these... Um, these came to $2.50. Originally, they're um, $4.99. And these come in at, for, with $144. I didn't, I only needed one of these, but, well, I just needed the one because it's for my owl. I did my, there, there it is. It's for this guy. I'm gonna put him on a necklace. So, like, the, these match him really well. And then these two things I bought at the same time, I might end up taking one of them back tomorrow when Manny, when I'm with Manny, because I don't, one of them I know will definitely fit, but I like this one better. Uh, they're both from the Charm Along brand, also it's Bead Landing, but from the brand Bead Landing from same brand here but they're called a charm along uh, like a sub brand called charm along this is a 20 inch 71.1 centimeter long necklace and it's a little weird let me just attempt getting it off i just have to keep everything together because i might actually be taking this one back eh, let go because if you can see this is a bit thick, but I really like it. It really matches with the owl. And there are, so like it hooks up to here, but, and I don't know why it's like this, but I'm thinking like I could easily hook it up like this to make it shorter or you like you make it longer. And it even comes with these to make it even longer. Wait, no, I can't, I can't even, I can't make it even longer, because the other side has to hook too, but whatever. Ugh. So, I don't know why this, there's this extra bit here. But, I want this one, but I purchased this one too, because it does come with two necklaces. Because if you can see this top part here, it's a bit thick. And like, this is already thick anyway. And then like, you see how small the, the rings are. That's why I've got this. This has two different tones. The top one's a bit darker, which is the one I'm probably going to end up using. And then this is a lighter tone, this this one here. I just wanted a plain chain, which is like this. But of the size, I got this just in case. And like, it does, they do match up nice. Like, especially the top one. It's hard to tell with this because it is so small. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. But yeah. These, uh, this one actually was on clearance. Even though it's not, not, not Mark. It said this was down from like four or something? Down to, um, three something. And like, this was not, but this was. But then with the, the, with the brand Charmalong, it was take off 40% off. So I don't know why this didn't have an additional anything off, but I got 40% off. It's okay. I'm okay. Everything's good. When I'm finished this video, I will test out this necklace to see if it all fits together. I went to Walmart because I needed to get three things. I only got two. I didn't have one of the things I needed. They didn't have my night wipes. Right, this first thing I'm pulling out is for my niece Charlotte. Look at this adorableness! It's so cute. It's like a monster sweater from Urban Planet. This is... I don't know what animal this is, but it's cute. It's adorable. 
And it has pockets. Look at that. It's got pockets here. And it's got a hood. With the ears on it. So it's a pop so it's a sweater monster. I don't know what kind of sweater monster it is because there's these little ears and it's I'm not exactly sure. Maybe it's a teddy pink teddy bear. I don't know. But this is a three T, so I'm thinking most likely for a three year old. <sighs> Next thing I got was these. Collector's Series Band-Aids by Johnson & Johnson. Brand adhesive bandages. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, you can kind of see it. And look, there's the back. Here are three different types of band-aids I get in this. There are 20 assorted sizes, so I get a fair amount. It's not just Mickey. There's a Mickey and Minnie one there. Like I needed some for like this, this, like this thing here. Ugh. Hit that thing. And then this thing here. So, I gotta heal myself up. Because I don't want to keep using the ones for my dad. Because I use a lot of the small ones. And even though it says here 20 assort assorted sizes, I hope they have more of the small sizes. Mickey's Mickey Mouse's original name was Mortimer. But Walt Disney's wife, Lillian, convinced Disney to change Mortimer to Mickey. Disney later used the later used a character named Mortimer Mouse as Mickey's rival in 1936. Huh. Well, there's 10 large and 10 small. Whatever. And I also bought Polysporn. Because I use... I, I kind of... I steal it. My dad steals it, and I steal it too. So now I just probably will end up buying it myself. And the sucky thing is, they don't have Polysporn at the dollar store. Which is weird. Because, like, if you're going to sell, like, you know, you're going to sell band-aids, you should probably have this with it, too. Whatever. Because, like, I paid, like, four bucks. No, it's, like, six bucks. And this is a smaller size. And the Walmart brand, because it's Equate, not the traditional polysporin. Yeah, it says uh, Antibiotic Ointment USP. It is the, um, the Vaseline-looking kind of one. I don't get the cream looking stuff. That's just weird. Yeah. Mm. Like, these are two of the things I needed. And then there was actually two more things that I really needed in here. Six things, and two of them I didn't really need, but, you know, I get to mark this off my Christmas shopping list. I finally found some witchcraft hardener that was not cloudy. It's perfectly clear. So I finally get to have the best stuff. And this actually, how much does it cost me again? I think it's $8.88. But I will pay that much for this because I love this stuff. The sad thing is it they don't have this on um, on their website. I don't know why. The other thing that I actually needed, well, was on my shopping list of what I wanted to get was um, a liquid eyeliner. And this is the Rimmel London One Black Skin. It is the Rimmel London Scandalous Eyes Precision Micro Eyeliner. It is new and it's waterproof, which is great. And this is a 24 up to 24 hours. This is in number one black. I prefer black. And it has an ultra fine tip, um, 0 0.04 fluid ounces felt tip, and this is basically what it looks like. I wanted a liquid eye pen or like a dry one. But all the ones I was finding, there was like, this one wasn't a really bad price. It was $7.98. Not a horrible price, but it's a price I really don't want to purchase for this. I would rather pay something else. But I needed to try something out. I, probably, I will end up buying this kind of stuff from e.l.f. because e.l.f. is a really nice cheap branding. It's like between one and three dollars depending on which you what you get. If you get the classic stuff it's usually like one to maybe two dollars. If you get the studio brand that is like three dollars about max. But I wanted I needed to try it out like now. So. And then the last thing that I didn't really need was a notebook. But it has a cute fox on it. 
And it's just, ugh. It's just, you know, a notebook with lined paper in it. Back to front. And it's polka dots here. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, the eyes. Close your eyes. Okay, it's gone. It's, excuse me, it's from the brand Shop Studio? The hair and the hair of the dog collection? I don't know. This is what the back looks like, and there's a website. So this will go after my little thinker notebook of use. That's all from Walmart until I do my online purchasing. Oh, I hope I have enough. And the last place is actually the first place I went shopping. It's Dollarama. And this is I really didn't need, but I added it to, um, I'm adding it to my candy giving collection, which is, this is the last stuff I'm purchasing, because, like, a lot of the stuff that's in the bag is, like, chocolate, and I didn't want to be just chocolate, so there's, this is more candy, but there is chocolate in here, so I'm, I'm going to show you the one thing I didn't need. But I got it because it's like, it's perfect. It's me. It is the Lori brand. I bought this before. It's the compact mirror, but it's got an owl on it. Look at it. It's perfect. It's me. I love owls. It's not really the color scheme I would like, but it's an owl. And I can put away the, um, the party girl thing, the party girl mirror, and use this. Because this is me. This is so much better because I'm not a party girl. Even though I want to go to this party, I want to go to it with Minnie. If I didn't have Minnie, I wouldn't be asking to go to this party. Alright, the thing I've been, had been wanting, like, I wanted to purchase these when I was purchasing the candy for the little treat bags, but for some reason they disappeared. But they were at this other uh, Dollarama that I really like going to, that's um, in the same plaza as the Super... Uh, super center Walmart that I like going to and it's these things these are chocolate lollipops and basically they come in these two styles there's the pumpkin one and the bat one these two are going to are going in those treat bags I didn't get one for Lauren she doesn't need all that chocolate cuz whatever and I bought one for myself um. <laughs> that like it's so cute I actually was gonna have four because I was gonna give one to Lauren. Whatever. And you would think I'd want this one because it probably would have white chocolate on it, but nah, I don't really want it. I want a pumpkin. Alright. Next thing I'm showing you is like a perfect thing. It's a three pack. And these are, uh, they're by the brand, I believe, Spooky Treats. Uh,. Pop, Halloween popping candy in three flavors. Uh, there's blue raspberry, not really for me, uh, strawberry, and then green apple. I'm keeping the green apple because I like that flavor. These two are going to into the treats. Uh, I think I know which one go, will go to which, but we shall see. And the last thing I purchased are these things by the brand Regal, I think it's that, called um, Lots of Fizz, uh, uh, filled with sour fizzy powder, bursting with flavor, and there's 65 pieces in here, may contain peanuts, tree nuts, milk, soya, wheat. But there's nothing actually in here that is bad. It's, you know, it's candy stuff. But there's, um, it's not like it contains, it's not like it's chocolate. Or it has any nuts in it or wheat. And, you know, the stuff that says here. So, I'm gonna... It looks like there's only three flavors. It looks like it, because there's a purple, an orange and red packets in here so I'm gonna get a bunch of these and then the rest I probably I might keep some and then like the rest I'm gonna put in with the uh 
the leftover candy that I'm going to get to the kids on Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh my god. Okay. That's everything I have for this really random weird haul. I'm going to be doing my online purchasing today. I gotta do two because one of them is I'm actually now going to be paying my bus pass. I'm gonna be putting the money on it. It's a presto pass so it's like a, a reloadable card. I'm just gonna do that online. I can do that apparently and then obviously the other thing is going to be my Walmart purchase <sighs> I hope I have enough and I hope like I when I do put the stuff I need on it that I will have what I need <sighs> but anyway I'm gonna go in I gotta deal with this necklace stuff I got only purchasing I gotta clean up I gotta deal with a few things so I will see you on my next video which most likely will be what will it be it will be at least one of two things. It will either be a book review or it will be a Holly Fair haul, which is coming up next Saturday. Not this coming Saturday because... No, no, it might not even be this. this uh, neither. So it most likely... Okay. Again, one of two things. A book review or an unboxing because if I'm paying it today... The um, Walmart said I'd be I'd be able to pick it up on uh, on November second, which is Monday. So yeah, so that's it. I'm gonna get going now. Like this video if you liked anything you saw. If you like seeing me, um, and you know, if you're new, if you're just watching this video new, please subscribe if you want to see more of these hauls. Excuse me, unboxing, unbagging, book reviews, and random, very random monthly favorite. I will see you all in another video, and I hope you have a lovely time after watching this video. Bye, everyone.